Alrighty, so I think I'll try to finish Bingo Highway, and I think that's gonna be the end of the session. Or, you know, the boss of Bingo Highway. <coughs> so I want to get as much footage as possible, but I don't want to run it to the point where I'm just not uh, enjoyable anymore because I want you guys to be in I want you guys to be enjoyed in everything. Do do do. I do kind of I do like Bingo Highway's music. It is very upbeat and everything. It sounds like something you listen to a club and then you, you slip a girl a roofie. Or you slip a girl a roofie oh if you're you're really stuck. Do I go down again? I get knocked down. I get up again. Yeah, I go down. <laughs> why game? Why? Why do you keep? Why do you keep doing like? Oh, oh gee, that was. What just happened? Bip bip. Dip bip. Dip. Another thing I don't like about this game is that um, the only time you can switch characters is when you're on the ground. So even if you try to switch a character in the air. Uh, you're gonna be the character that you're trying to change from until you hit the ground. So in places like Bingo Highway, where, like, Bingo Highway Rail uh, Station, uh, not Rail Sta I did it again! Rail Canyon! That's what I'm talking about, Rail Canyon! Uh, where your, uh, teammates split up a lot. Um, it, there's, man, that fucking phone. Anyway, um, there's a lot of times where it, it just, it just doesn't. No, it just doesn't. Man, I'm shooting the fuck out of that guy. There we go. Hit that. Hit that. And then here we go. Then you hit that. There we go. No problem. Let's get... <laughs> See, the funny thing about that line, you know, uh... No problem. Let's get moving. Is because beforehand, Rouge usually says, um... Usually says, We can't move forward! And then Shadow's like, no problem, let's get moving. <laughs> I just said we can't go forward. What do you want? We're gonna move forward anyway. Because that is the willpower of the ultimate life form. Oh yeah, I... I no, I don't go down. I get knocked down, <laughs> I get up again. <laughs> Game. Game quit it. Game. Uh, oh, oh, almost there. Almost there. That that egg machine had no chance. What is that thing called? The aerial egg thing. Plus these pedal robots. What are what are uh what are they called? What I I know stuff is like the egg pot. Isn't that isn't this like the egg flyer or something? I want to see the robots from 06 because those were definitely designed well. I still remember the uh, legacy missions from uh. Uh, from Black Knight, where it just replaced the, uh, the enemies with, like, uh, egg ponds, and that was weird, but it was alright. It was just, like, a different mission. Man, game, you know what'd be great? If you fucking did what I told you to. Psh! Just keep slapping it. Don't go, don't go down. Don't go down, because I'm gonna have to get back up again. I... Man, you hear me hitting that button? how frustrated I am. Or you can just look at the flippers where they're just like, eh. You... Oops, no. Mm -hmm. no. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Dot. Oh my god. They placed that one on purpose. How... What is... What are the... What are these physics? What are... The, what are... Mm. Alright, now I'm starting to get a little upset because these physics don't make sense. It's just like, oh, I kind of hit that thing with a little speed. Let's keep going until you do. <sighs> line up. No, I don't want to line up next to you. Screw you, Omega. I'm the top of the class. I'm the leader of the team. I don't need your shit. All right. Up, up, up. And up, and up. I get knocked down. I get up again. There we go. <coughs> I really hardly play. I hardly play as the power characters. I usually like going fast because I have quick reaction time. Um, so usually I don't play this as the strong character because you know they're just too slow. You're too slow. Oh, 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 oh. Man, they making out. Looked like they were making out for a second. It was pretty hot. Got uploaded to rule 34pahil.net. Oh yeah, that's right. I can't kill that thing. Except that I can. I can't. 
There we go. So we're still in Bingo Highway, and I'm pretty much sick of this place. Man, I'm hungry. I need some lunch. It's 11.30. It is 11.25. Yeah. <clears throat> nope, 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 nope. There we go. Alrighty. Now I gotta avoid some holes, which I'm pretty sure there's gonna be more of them since it's Team Dark, because, you know, hey, let's just have all these bottomless pits. Because bottomless pits are always fun, especially that's why Castlevania got so much praise. Why does that game have so much praise? That You should have gotten that six. You, you should have gotten, gotten that seven. Dude, I got both of them. Bet you didn't expect that. Because that's semi-impossible to get both of them. <laughs> anyway, so we're still in Bingo Highway. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. At least I still have footage. It's fun having footage. I already said that like a thousand times, but you know. Oh, yeah, I gotta go down. You know what? Screw you. I don't need your flippers. No, stop. See? When I'm trying to go down, Omega's just like, hey, let's keep moving, like, all over the place. That's not what Omega sounds like. He more sounds like, eh, I am a robot. That's what Omega sounds like. But I don't like doing that voice because it makes... it... it's hard to do. Dude, I totally got... how... just got past it. You know, I don't even need your problems. But that is kind of the cool thing with Sonic Heroes, is that it's not really designed like, uh, Adventure. It's very... I wouldn't say... Adventure was a lot more compact, but Sonic Heroes has a lot more distance. And I don't think that has to do with the length of the stages, because it can have something to do with it in certain respects. But, uh, I don't think it has to do with the length of the stages. It's a lot more focused on keeping you going, and in, in a lot of respects, that does work. But in others... Again, there's times where it's just like, um, going a little too fast here. Annihil kill, Annihil kill. Man, you're not supposed to say kill. This, this, an e, this is an E game, is it? I don't know. It's probably like E10. Because Sonic games always get that weird rank, which is like E10, and you're not sure why, and it's because of this one moment in the game where it happens, and it's bizarre. Has a Sonic game ever been teen? Like, not even, like, Shadow the Hedgehog was teen. Which was bizarre. But I thought I don't think there's ever been a Sonic game that was teen. Uh, oh, I'm talking about the e e S ESRB. Um, that was a funny thing with the ESRB. Uh, with Sonic Unleashed. <laughs> you know where this story's going. Uh, with Sonic Unleashed, it was E10+. Plus, and uh, I understand because, you know, you're beating the shit out of stuff and then they, you know, die. So I guess it, it was like realistic punches. It wasn't like, oh, pew pew, laser stuff. But it was like realistic punches. I guess that's why it was on the back. But it also had animated blood on the back, you know, for e for the E10 Plus rating. And I didn't understand why, because, you know, when you beat up enemies, there wasn't really a whole... There wasn't blood at all. So it was kind of weird. And then I beat the game, and I found out why that they had animated blood on the back. That... Dark guy of transformation. Oh boy, I completely missed that thing. Man, stop putting bumpers in the way. It's just like Casimir. It's just like, oh, this is where you're supposed to go. Let's put everything imaginable in the way. I don't like Castlevania. I don't. I just, it's not, it's not me. I, I meant, to, don't go to Rouge because she's dead. Also, don't go to. Have you ever? There's, there's been tons of times where you're playing, like, uh, Bingo Highway and stuff like that, where, um, where, oh, no, 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 I cheated on this part, so I don't know how long it's gonna take without it, um, and, uh, 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 it's gonna take no time at all, yeah, anyway, so that is the end of Bingo Highway and Casino Park, but what I was talking about before, I've ever switched to a character in one of these stages, and the character happens to be falling to their death. And you can't switch back, that's what I was trying to talk about before, uh, when you can't switch back with, uh, uh, when you're in the air. And that becomes a problem when you're a character that is separated from the pack, and they're falling to the, they're falling to their death. That becomes a problem. Why is it that you can't change a character mid-air? That'd be pretty helpful in a lot of situations. But you're, you're mostly limited in a lot of situations. That is a big slot machine. Dude, how did he even build that? Why do I... <laughs> here's, <laughs> here's my answer. Who gives what memory? 
Oh. Oh, Eggman's a dick. He's he, he's using Shadow's amnesia to his advantage. You have no past to remember. And that's that's kind of what the plot is. We're just like, oh, Shadow, blah blah blah, and stuff. I don't want to say it because for those of you that haven't played Sonic Heroes and don't know the general story to it. I know there probably isn't a whole lot of you, but just in case, I don't want to keep going. The only thing I said about the Metal Sonic one was because it was obvious. He was just sitting there, right, like, even my, just, like, the descriptions I write for the playlists, like, um, oh, first of all, here's the Team Blast. Omega's just like, uh, oh, Rouge doesn't really do a whole lot, and then time freezes. Yeah. I am the ultimate power. But anyway, um, the thing... Again, what I said about Metal Sonic is because it was freaking obvious. Which is like a life form data successfully copied. Like who who doesn't look at that and say that guy's a villain right there? Why do I get hurt if I touch their lance? That's not how a lance works. You know how a lance works? You touch the pointy part. You don't touch the tut the side is especially round and soft. Well, it's not soft, but it's not pointy. It's not rough, as we say. It's very soft, very round. It's very rounded. It's got a nice rounded personality. It's a well-rounded character. I'm going for puns, but they're not working. I don't have the power eye that I usually have. But anyway, <clears throat> it's not how a lance works. That's what I, that's what's always bothered me in some games like this, where you get like touch damage. Uh, where uh, you touch the side of the character, and then uh, you don't get hurt. But when you touch a specific part of it, then you get hurt. Like, the homing attack is supposed to protect me from getting hit. Uh, unless I'm getting hit from the side. But when I homing attack the lance, then I get hurt. What sense does that make? Well, guess what? They're all, you're all dead! There is one disadvantage for using the team blast, because even though it does freeze time, it, um... It works against you because when you're in a place where you need the progression of the stage to move along, uh, you have to wait until your team blasts up. Granted, time doesn't move while the team blast team team blast team blast is under effect. Um, what are you doing, man? <sighs> but it's still annoying just to sit there and wait until the character until time is back. Annihilate charge, fire. Activation ready. Yeah, I'm going up. Man, this boss fight is so fun. No, it's not. Uh, uh, bombs. Bombs? Not an oil rope. <laughs> boop, boop. Yep, yep. Can't hurt him. But I can. Using the Chaos Control. Why does Shadow have the Chaos Emerald? Where do you get the Chaos Emerald? That is a question I would like answered, and I don't know the answer to that. How does he have a Chaos Emerald? Every time, he's just like, I gotta get a Chaos Emerald. Doctor, stop the sense. You underestimated us, didn't you? Oh, great, more pawns. Great, I got hurt again. They're golden. And again, the homing attack is supposed to protect me with certain areas if I'm hitting the enemy. The most that should happen is, uh, I am, I have no rings. I, I would like a team blast, please. I, I definitely would like that. I gotta be fucking careful. Oh, wait. <laughs> it would help if I just did that. You know, if it, All right, okay, team blast. I don't want to take any chances. I don't want to do this fight again because um, these fights don't have checkpoints, so I don't want to, you know, sit here and be like, yeah, okay, I gotta do that. Blah, 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 blah. It'd be great if I had rings. That would be nice. I don't want to die. Please don't let me die. Don't let me die, senpai. That rhymed. Kind of. It did rhyme. Not kind of. Eggman, how many easy ones do you have? Uh, I have quite a lot, actually. Uh. <laughs> I don't know what that was. Uh. So anyway, we just beat uh, Eggman, uh, beat all of his easy robots, apparently. The easy ones, apparently. But, you know, that usually happens, you know, the easy ones. But since I'm done with Casino Park and everything else, so, guys, I'm actually going to end it off here. So, guys, if you enjoyed uh, if you enjoyed this session of Team Dark in Sonic Heroes, then please tune in next time while we go to Rail Canyon again.